Hi guys, this video is super exciting for me because I will be trying out Ambunu. Um, if you haven't checked YouTube yet, there's a big fuss about Ambunu. It's a natural detangler um, and also you can use it as an alternative to shampooing. And you know we want to sort of stay away from shampooing our hair too often and i would like to mention my naturalbeauty.com.au if you're in australia you can get this product um, if you're interested in it and you guys are lucky because you can get a 15 percent off just head out to their website mynaturalbeauty.com.au and use the code pamara15 for a 15 percent off everything so not just ambunu but a whole lot of other things she does all sorts of natural things if you're interested in, in um jamaican black castor oil or you know bentonite clay of which you know i will be doing a video for that one as well so i was super excited to try ambunu um it screamed my name when i saw it because of just the beautiful benefits it has for our hair not only does it make your hair soft and gives it a sheen it also helps with dry scalp and lessens hair loss and i got the 150 grams and this is supposed to actually last you quite a bit or quite a while and the instructions say to use just one tablespoon in one liter of water i decided to use only two cups of water because i just didn't think i'd need a liter um, of the product and just on first uh, look of Ambunu it actually reminded me of um, a certain wild okra that we have in Zambia we call it Derelea Kumunzi or Derelea Kumunzi or something like that it reminded me of that and I think it might be it although I can't confirm that yet so I just went ahead to boil some water guys and um, I measured one tablespoon of the ambunu after which i poured two cups of hot water into the ambunu leaves and just stirred it really lightly before allowing it to sit for 10 minutes actually no i actually um let it sit for 15 minutes although the instructions say to let it sit for 10 so after a good 15 minutes of allowing the water and the leaves to just sit um, you can tell that the ambunu has become a bit slimy and once again it reminded me of okra you know if you put okra with water or hot water this is the texture or the kind of feel that you get and i just put everything into a little bottle um, including the leaves and just shook that a little bit and I was all ready to go ahead and start using it. Now I have left my hair, you know, in an old twist out for about two weeks now and I'm just going to, you know, obviously try the product out. I have pretty much followed the instructions as much as possible, obviously, without making a liter of um, the Ambunu concoction um, but I haven't added anything because I really want to see how it works on its own um, and my hair is super tangled so we're really going to see how it performs in here obviously if you want to add some other things in there it might be even more beneficial but in this video I'll just be trialing the product all by itself I've left the leaves in there because it says that the leaves come out quite easily and I'm a bit nervous about that because I don't want little things picking them out all day um, but yeah, I've left them in there so that we can see how it actually works. So let's have a look at my hair. Yeah, it's a mess in there. I'm just going to start off with some water just to make it easy for me to handle and part it. the ambunu in this bottle um, the leaves seem to sit up at the bottom which works for me I mean I'm not really trying to get the leaves in there but 
um, I think it might be easier for me to just pour it onto the hair rather than use this one. So let's get started. So when I first started um, using the Ambunu, I was trying really hard to not have any leaves in my hair and I was hoping to get the same effect of you know being able to cleanse my scalp and have a little bit of form you know because i've seen in other videos people get a bit of form when they put the ambunu in their hair which is really good if you're using it as a shampoo alternative but also you know i was looking for some slip uh, with the product just to help me detangle and look at those curls <laughs> i thought to myself whoo we've got something you know happening here and it's very exciting because it's a natural product however you know the more i actually tried to detangle my hair the more i realized although it does make my curls pop um i wouldn't say it offers me enough sleep to be a standalone detangler if you know what i mean but i thought to myself again i don't want to make the conclusion really quickly like that because you know to be honest i haven't actually put the leaves in my hair and so i decided to use it again on another piece of hair just to make sure and yeah i did have some curls popping but not so much sleep once again so i decided to go full throttle leaves and everything in there and surprisingly the leaves i find really help with the lather you know i just find that you know putting the leaves in my hair just helped bring a little bit more slip to my hair and also you know help the the ambunu just form up on my hair a little bit just like a shampoo obviously it's not you know the same lather when using a shampoo a shampoo will give you much more lather but for a natural product i thought wow you know this actually did quite a good job so after finger detangling i went in with a wide tooth comb to try and get all the knots out and i did you know have to give it a bit of time to work you know and also to tease my tangles a little bit but eventually it did actually help um detangle my hair i feel like this product will work much better you know in combination with other products or other natural you know plants or herbs you know things like aloe vera or maybe slippery elm i feel can make an amazing detangler you know when combined with ambunu um, as a natural shampoo and as an alternative for shampooing your hair like every week for people that wash their hair every week i feel like this is actually really really good given the added benefits of helping you with hair loss and you know hair thinning and you know your dry scalp it really um, is a good option in that regard Another observation that I made was that, um, yeah, it's a little bit messy, guys. <laughs> um, make sure to use a an old t-shirt or just, you know, clothes that you don't mind getting dirty because you can see it's all over me. Maybe I'm applying it wrongly. I don't know. If you have some tips, let me know. But, you know, yeah, it is messy. And my floor was really covered with you know ambunu leaves and etc so do not do this on a carpet So 
after rinsing my hair super thoroughly i still had leaves in my hair guys <laughs> this was my worst nightmare i didn't want to be spending my time taking leaves out of my hair but it happened and i had to spend some time actually trying to get the leaves out which was not as successful because they're just stuck in there so maybe this can work for looser textures i don't know if you've used ambunu before and you didn't have leaves stuck in your hair please let me know comment below let me know what you've done i feel like this was a good experience for me because i have got a great idea on what i'm gonna do to make this work for my hair because let's be honest we want all the benefits that ambunu has to offer but this we don't want i have to say though my hair felt really soft it wasn't stripped at all and my scalp was actually clean despite the leaves and i feel like this is a great alternative for shampooing our natural hair if we can figure out what to do about these leaves uh, i've got more videos to come on ambunu just look out on the channel i will be dropping some great ideas on how this can work for kinky hair um, without you having to spend lots of time trying to get leaves out of your hair until next time don't forget to subscribe